Mr. Jake LaTurner. Madam Speaker, I rise in strong support of energy producers across our country and especially in my home state of Kansas. Over the past nine months, the Biden administration has put American energy producers on the back burner. Kansans are already paying over 40% more at the pump than they were last year. And yet my colleagues across the aisle want to ram through a reckless $3.5 trillion spending spree that would lead to the largest tax increase on working families and small businesses in decades. There is a laundry list of bad policy in this spending spree, including the Clean Electricity Performance Program, a federal takeover of our nation's electricity. This $150 billion program would dictate how we power our homes, businesses, and everyday life. Democrats want to mandate energy providers to distribute a certain amount of renewable energy to their customers. Those who comply will get grants from the Department of Energy, while those falling short would have to pay fees to the federal government. This plan is absolutely ridiculous and will only make energy more expensive, undermine our grid reliability, and make our nation even more dependent on communist China. As these massive Democrat spending sprees continue to make their way through committees and eventually to the House floor, I will continue to fight for Kansas energy producers. Our focus needs to be encouraging domestic energy production across the country, having a robust energy portfolio, and ending our reliance on foreign energy. Democrats seem to think it's impossible to have affordable, bountiful, and innovative energy while also having clean air and water. That's simply not true. Oil and gas produced here in the United States is among the cleanest and safest in the world. It's time to end the assault on our energy producers and return to American energy independence. Thank you, and I yield back. I thank the gentleman for Kansas.